All right, welcome back to part four. No, oh, we're live. Because, all right, I got great news. Uh, for the past year, I've been going insane looking for my war box um, or my shadow box. And uh, just uh, last week, Barack Obama, we heard the doorbell ring and we see three black cars. And out of nowhere, there's Barack Obama himself, President Barack Obama, with my war box. He says, you left us at my house when we got drunk the other day, General. Yep, you did. I saw it. And he gave me my war box back. Hell yeah, look at all those mouths. They don't call me the General for nothing, goddammit. Oh, man. So. Highly decorated. Thank you, President Barack Obama. The highly decorated fighting machine. <laughs> drinking machine, baby. Yeah, drinking, drinking and war machine. Those medals are for drinking. I don't know what y'all think. <laughs> He drank Gaddafi under the table, man. Oh, bad. Uh, you ever, you ever stop more wars with drinking contests than any yeah, other soldier? Fucking <laughs> okay, that Civil War guy, uh, SS uh, Lee, yeah. got nothing on me. Nothing. He ain't got shit. He thought he was a drunk. Yeah, he thought he was He, he thought he was the general. Uh, all kidding aside, we support Barack Obama, President Barack Obama. Support you, brother. Uh, I like that guy. He's cool. All right. Uh, we already talked about YouTube being well, queer. It's not YouTube. It's the people being queer. Yeah, it's not. It's not the. Oh. It's not the moderators, I guess. On the side. Uh, they can, they only do what their job is. All right. They never said nothing about us. So it was bad. Lad uh, has some NBA news. Yeah. And I and I also have some after that. But go ahead, Lad. Uh, Yao Ming retired last night, man. After eight seasons. Yeah, it's like it was like a flash in the pan. With yeah, him. he had like a total of maybe three good seasons, three good years. They never made it past the first, second round. Man, they he was. You know who I'm more disappointed though? Yeah, I mean, because at least Yami can say, "Hey, I'm a big, big freak of nature," but you know he has his weak points, which are obviously the, the ankles, the feet, killing yeah. heels. He's a big guy. You can't blame him for that. Uh, no, the one I'm disappointed in is McGrady. He had guy, all the talent, man. That guy bitched out every chance he gets. He had all the talent, but none of the the drive. No charisma, no drive, no leadership, no nothing. Nope. Nope. He's, he's a perfect example of what somebody when somebody's all about themselves equals Tracy McGrady. But uh, now, look at him. What, have you heard anything from him lately? Nothing. nothing. Was, last I heard, he was with the Knicks. And he's not even there anymore. He's not even there anymore. He might as well not even be playing anymore. Until unless somebody just. Besides to pay him like the minimum or something. I'm not saying he doesn't have talent. I'm just saying he lacks leadership. He lacks self motivation. He just made his money. And that's it. Yeah, that's, that's all it was. Money. So I was, now being poor guy, he's playing his heart out. He gets hurt. Uh, I'll say the Yao Ming was a little bit overrated because he was going to make the All Star team no matter what. Because of the all the, the votes. No, all the votes oh. from China. Look, I, I liked Yao Ming. They should have gave him to a better team. They're the reason he, he crumbled under pressure because they expected they expected him to pull the franchise. That guy needed a supporting role. Tracy Tracy McGrady should. couldn't be it. Oh yeah, the only guy that they brought him was Tracy, Tracy McGrady. McGrady. He couldn't do it. Nope. He just yeah. he bitched out. He says, you know what? I have Yao Ming here. He can do it. And of course, you're gonna fucking stress out your, your best player like that. So the poor guy after eight seasons has to retire. Well, he's just like any other big guy. They always, yeah, yeah. They always fall up there with the injuries on their feet and their feet because. Yeah, you know, you're so big. That's why Tim Duncan is a bitch now, because he's afraid to play basketball. He's afraid of his ankles. He's like, and, oh, I don't want to get hurt. His ankles and his feet and all that no shit. No offense, Tim, but come on, even you can say that. Yeah, but you know, Duncan's played a long time. Yeah, yeah, he's smart. He's won titles. He's, he's uh, bitch smart. <laughs> yeah, no, he's bitch smart. I say, you know, Duncan, man, if you think the season's gonna not going to happen, just retire from You know he opted out. That is, <clears throat> what, what contract? This year? So he still spurred, but apparently he opted out of his contract. Oh, good for him. Fuck him. It came out on ESPN. They were talking about work on the base. Uh, Tim Duncan, for uh, the San Antonio people, who y'all, oh, y'all love Tony Parker and Tim Duncan. Your, your best man opted out, y'all. He still spurred. But since the lockout, you, you don't hear about it. Only if you have cable or the NBA TV like we do. But <laughs> y'all don't know he opted out. TK is breaking that news for you. Tim Duncan of San Antonio Spurs has opted out of his contract. Yep. Well, uh, well after the season, right? No. Because he had one more season. Because he could, he wouldn't be a Spur right now. He's he still had... here. 
he's under contract for one for this season. But I think what happened was he opted out of the rest of his contract. Oh, okay, okay. Either so, way, he still opted out. Yeah, he opted out, which means that if they play this season or they don't play, he's yeah. going to retire after, you know, next June. So, you know, hey, you know. Uh, you know, it we'll, brings we'll, me to another point. I don't think there's going to be an NBA season. No, no, but we'll get back to Yao Ming. Um, I, I like Yao Ming, but I just think he needed a better team. Poor guy, though, man. Come on. Yeah. I, I hate to see a player go out like that. Yeah. Not, you know. Uh, now, on the other hand, who's the other guy that was the number one draft pick and all his knees go out? Oh, twice for already. the Blazers. Yeah. What's his uh, name? Uh, it's not uh, Odin. It's yeah, Odin. Odin, right? Greg Odin. Greg Odin. The man, the, the hundred million dollar man that has only yeah, played like thirty games. Yeah, I, I, I guess you gotta feel for that guy. Look, when you're a rookie, you want to play. You want to get out there. You get hurt, you get hurt. Uh, these big guys go down easily like that, but you know you gotta feel for the guy. He wants to play. His team even says we know, but the team is looking to sell them. Yeah, because he can't do anything. He can't. No, not only is he. <laughs> Not only are, have they not seen him play, he's been hurt so that's much. Like, that's, like telling, that's like telling a guy, look, you have a, a 14 inch member. A 14 inch jump. Yeah, yeah you got a 14 inch jump. But you'll jump. never be able to get it up. Nope. Never. I mean, you could get it up, but we're not sure if it'll stay. <laughs> <laughs> so, the TK, that's our, uh, that's our theory. It's like telling some guy, yeah, you have a 14-inch member, baby. Uh, we just don't know if it's going to work. And if it doesn't work, okay, if something goes wrong, you're going to be out for a year. And then no, no, see. they're pretty much saying that if it doesn't work, you're still going to have a 14-inch. <laughs> you still have a 14-inch member, but you're going to be out for a year. You're not going to get it up, and then we'll see what goes We'll from see here. what happens. Uh, <laughs> so that's pretty much his situation. Yeah, that's a bad situation, man. So, you know, he's... He, <laughs> God. <laughs> oh man, the only news Tony Parker will make uh, this year, because there's not going to be an NBA season, I'm telling you. Man, he was out there on uh, a fucking water jet On a water jet pack. that's the only news he's going to make, man. I'm not caring about, look, that's your spur there, you guys should be worried about his health. He's 29. Be worried about him staying injury free, and there he is. I'm probably one of the world's dangerous uh, this jackass fan boys. Fifty grand, one hundred fifty. No, those five thousand. Five thousand per day. Per, per day. Oh no, I'm sorry. It's like per hour. Yeah, per hour. Five grand an hour. On a water. On a water jetpack. Jetpack. Jet All right. He's got his own cartoon in France, did you know? Yeah, it's called uh, "How to Let Your Team Down While Cheating on Your Best Friend with His Wife." With the Ghostbusters. Yeah. And <laughs> Jim. <laughs> that, that's how. That's his new cartoon. That's his new cartoon, man. And that's Tony Parker, a guy that should not be here with Spurs. Uh, but your fans love him. Yeah, right. apparently everybody loves his ass. There's I, not going to be a season. I'm telling you. I don't know the guy's name. The um, Falcons. Yeah, that guy's name for the Falcons. Um, but apparently, uh, there's a lockout because of money issues, right? Because the players are yeah. getting enough money. They cannot figure out how to uh, share nine yeah, billion yeah. dollars. So. They're complaining about money. Even the players are complaining about money that they're not getting enough. So we have this this uh, this guard or power forward. That's what it was from the Atlanta Falcons. Do a basketball training camp at his former uh, high school. The guy rolls up with almost like a six hundred thousand. Oh, you mean the Atlanta Hawks? The Atlanta Hawks. I'm sorry. Atlanta basketball. Hawks. Basketball. Power forward from the Atlanta Hawks. Uh, they both sorry that team. Yeah, they both uh, sorry. This guy shows up with with nearly a truck worth of like six hundred thousand dollars the paint was gold the rims were ridiculous uh it was and, and then this is a guy that's complaining about he doesn't get enough money and he's rolling up with a house on wheels at the camp showing the kids yeah this is what i roll so what the hell is that about they're complaining bs man they this greedy fox you know Beyond greedy, man. You don't be like, I need money because, you know, I'm, I'm barely struggling as an NBA player. You show up with a fucking... And then roll up with a million dollar car. <laughs> How selfish uh, is that? Very. Extremely, man. Extremely. 
But you know, that's just the way they are, man. That's what these guys are. I'll tell you, I don't care that there's not going to be an NBA season. I'll give a fuck. Well, I'm mad because that only gives popularity to fucking NASCAR and baseball and hockey. Three of the worst sports ever. Their popularity is rising because of this. Wrestling. Is it a popular, not enough. Popular, not enough. I say the popularity of wrestling will go up because not enough. It will barely make a dent. I, I think it will go up substantially because of no football, no basketball. The NASCAR season doesn't go year round. Like, what it does or does? I think uh, it's almost almost like like seven months. Uh, baseball baseball goes year round. They get like one month off, one and a half month, two months, and then it's like training again. Kind of like yeah. what the fuck? I hate baseball. Spring we're already in spring training. Just ended the season. Jesus. Uh, fucking, uh, nobody gives a fuck about hockey. Uh, I like going to the games because you don't know if you're going to die or not. You know, those pucks fly in the sand, like, holy shit. shit. <laughs> Some guy just died at the Rangers game the other night. Wow. How does that happen? Well, uh, one of the outfielders. It, it happens, but it's rare. Uh, outfielder Josh Hamilton, he threw a foul ball to the guy. He was with his son. Oh. And the guy reached over the gate. To grab it and he fell over. Well, come on, that's you know that's the guy's fault. And he got head injuries and he died. You know that they warn you about leaning over the rails like that because a, it's fucking high. Uh, B, you're gonna fall. And C, you're gonna get injured, probably possibly dead. The dude was a firefighter too. Should have saw that coming, man. Actually, he's the second firefighter to die. And I major league baseball. Wow. What do you guys think they're invisible? Oh, I, got this <laughs> shit. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't, it's just a fucking crazy coincidence. <laughs> He's like, I got this. I can do it. <laughs> I slide down rails. Oh, shit, man. It's horrible, man, because the sun saw him. Yeah. The sun saw that. Way to scar your boy for life. Jeez. Yeah, you get your kids. He's never going to go to another baseball game. Or he'll probably hate that team for life. The Rangers? Yeah. Fuck. Yeah, you know. Uh, I think the Rangers are going to, like, they're gonna do what they can to help the family. for PR, you know. Yeah. But I mean, the funeral. it's not the Rangers' fault. No, I, I, look to the sun. When if you're watching this in the future, uh, it, it was your dad's fault. You should not have done that. There's clearly rules on there that says do not lean over the fucking rails. Yeah, that's what happens. That's why there's. Oh, uh, there's a part of the video they stopped showing it. A uh, video where he could have grabbed back. He could have grabbed onto the rail. But he was more focused on getting the ball, <laughs> and you know, <laughs> it's a fucking that's what happened. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it. Hope, I hope he got it as he went down with the ship. I hope he, yeah, I hope yeah, he I hope, I hope he got it because he paid the. Do you think they sacrifice. gave? Do you think they gave the ball to the sun? Oh man, they're gonna give him more than just. <laughs> the they're gonna give him more than just. It's the like ball. it's like I'm the the coach of the Rangers. Give him the ball. Give him all the balls. Give him the team. Give him, <laughs> give him everything, man. I don't, I don't know what to do. You know what they'll probably end up doing is uh, they'll name that section of the, the beaches to, that, to his name. Yeah, they probably would. They probably would. To uh, Major Dumbass. Ah, major Dumbass. You're not supposed to do that, alright? You're not. That's what happens. Well, what happens if I push the button? Well, I don't know. Let's push it. You know? You're, yeah, I know. You're not supposed to fucking die. At Let me hit this uh, this beehive and not run. But really, it could happen to anybody. You, know, you just lose your balance and you fucking. If you want to die, don't get me wrong. I mean, just accidents. Accidents, accidents happen. Accidents happen. Yes. Uh, but when when there's a self-made accident, when you clearly are aware of the uh, of the potential harm, mm -hmm. you can't really you know go after the team like that. None of the guys fall. Uh, it sucks, hey, don't get me wrong. Uh, our condolences to the family. Yeah, man, bro. Uh, but uh, you gotta say the guy died doing probably what he liked being. He was doing what he did, man. It's what his son has many times. Now he's scarred his son for life. Fuck <laughs> yeah. Man, I don't know what you can't, you can't come back from that shit. Yeah, we'll end up with another sad note. We'll come back. All right. Bye. Fuck you, Trump. Trump, you're an asshole.